symbol of the goddess. Mm-hmm. Hmm. I think maybe she will help me see. Okay. So just, just connect with that symbol now. You just have to feel the connection with the symbol of the goddess so that we can move further and discover more now about your guides and any messages they have for you at the moment. Feel yourself with a deep connection to that symbol now. Very deep connection. You're connected to that symbol now. You tell me what, what's happening. There's a lady on my left who was a shaman before. What does she look like? She's very old. Very old. She looks like she's just come from um, living off the land. Yeah. Okay. And does she notice you? Yes. Okay. She's got very dark hair. Yeah. And if if you ask her. Um, what what is she what is her purpose with you? What is she helping guide you with? With embracing the shamanic techniques that she's trying to help me with in combination with theirs, their energy. She has always channeled them through her energies. Who's them? Her guides. Okay. Or her connection to their energies. Okay. So she's, she's here to help you with shamanic teachings at the moment. Yes. Okay. What, what kind of teachings? Is she trying to help you with specifically? Releasing entities. All right. Yep. Yeah. And does okay. she have any suggestions for you? If you ask her what, uh, what kind of... Something about using different frequencies and different... And music. And music? Yes, she knows how to, she's been, they've been teaching me to connect to music through my healings. Okay, so is that something that you can be using in your healing? Yes, that's why. I have been using them to transport people into their world. Right. And you do that with, there's different frequencies. Yes. <coughs> Music. Which are connected to a higher frequency. Mm. Okay. So what, what suggestions does she have specifically for you to take action on? What can you do to improve your shamanic work? Or embrace those shamanic teachings? I think she's saying that I need to explore the world a bit more. Like travel or? Mm, collect more information from specific people. They are coming. They've all been guided to me. Oh, okay. Yes. Okay, so collect more information around, look inform yes. around music. And healing modalities. All right. What kind of healing modalities? Uh, ones that are closer to her style. Okay. Ones that connect her with the spirit world in a quicker way. Okay. Um, 
to channel in a different way and channel different beings from now on. Okay, so what? And yeah. not to be afraid of them. Oh, what kind of process know. does she advise for, you, for channeling? Just to allow myself to come into a state of trance mm -hmm. easier and to invite them in. I have not invited them in. I have not allowed them to come in with more information. Right, and how can you best do that? How can you invite them in, in a safe way? I ask for it to appear in a safe way. I don't know, she's not saying that there's a procedure. All right. She's saying that there's just an openness that I need to have. Openness that you need to have. I'm not open to the lower energy or the different vibrations, which I consider lower vibrations. Right. That are the old existing spirits or energies that is connected to shamanism. I've seen this already in other shamans. Okay, so how can, how can you be more open to that? attending class or connecting with those to swap yeah. information. Mm. Okay. Do you have any other messages for you? No.